Okay guys, so today what we're going to do is another one of the LOL Surprise OMG uh, fashions. You guys know that LOL Surprise doesn't have fashion packs as of yet, and we are clamoring for them. We want them so much, we want them, want them, want them, but I'm very impatient, so I made my own fashion packs and I found different places where I could purchase doll clothes and do different things to my dolls to give them different looks, and so we're doing another video like that today. You know, in the past I've done these videos where I kind of had the dolls kind of sitting over there on a like a little riser they're like in bleachers almost and I, I kind of pull them down one by one to show them but today I'm doing something a little different I am just doing big reveals as we go along so no sneak peeks here so guys without any further delays let's go ahead and get to the fashions okay guys so the first doll we have right here is Royal B out of the box she's glam okay but I wanted to give her a little different look and she actually has on an outfit that I got from Haunt Couture um, it actually is a top and then it has a skirt on the bottom that's underneath here and this is Neonlicious like overall dress thing I don't know what it is exactly but it looks like a dress and overall so that's what I call it and so she has that on and I thought that was a cute little look and then she's got these glasses on guys that are my Minnie Mouse glasses so I think she looks so fantastic along with some shoes that I was able to purchase online which I think are fab love the gold on them it looks great so guys this is the look that I have for Royal B so this is one of our original girls. She's an OG. This is Lady Diva. And Lady Diva, I actually did her like in the little Chun-Li, like buns in the top. I thought that was cute. Look for her. This skirt actually is a Minnie Mouse skirt. And she actually has on Snowlicious's top, but I turned them backwards because I want to give them little jackets instead of like a little top. Because if you look, this is the back of the top. And I love these little button-like earrings. Uh, they go with all kinds of different outfits and stuff that I do for my girls so I think that looks cute for Lady Diva and her shoes she has on Snowlicious's shoes and these shoes are fab and so guys this is the look that we have for Lady Diva okay so this is Crystal Star so I wanted to give her a more casual like look and I gave her this belt this belt I actually got online in a lot of doll clothes that I purchased it was like a bunch of different pieces and I thought that was cute so this looks like sweater with a look with the kind of shirt hanging down the little tails hanging out I thought was a cute little look for her and these boots I mean they are so fab you know these are Lady Diva's boots and they make her look like a total diva too this is just a very simple look but I think it looks great on her I cannot get enough of swag she is one of my favorite dolls uh, because I think she's kind of like a chameleon I mean she looks great in everything every single thing and today I did a cute little look for her and she actually has on so many different pieces this I got online but she's got a Royal B's little top Uptown BB's little boy shorts and this belt I believe is Cosmic Nova's belt she's got Cosmic Nova's glasses on and these boots oh I gave her some little knee pads guys and I think these are like monster high I thought they were cute and then these boots guys I'm sure these are monster high but I thought that that went great with her outfit and this is the look that I created for her just some random little pieces that I had like earrings and necklace and stuff but I thought it went great with the color scheme so guys this is the look that I have for swag and she is a groovy babe and at first when I got her I thought she was a little plain Jane so I always like to do different things with her I used some washable Crayola markers to color her dress uh, please excuse where I went outside of the lines but I wanted you guys to see how easy you can kind of do that if you want to do some coloring these are washable markers I should be able to wash them right out and um, I thought it was a cool way to give her a different look in her dress and she's got on these boots to kind of pull out the pop of pink and so guys that is the look that I created for groovy babe okay so this next look that we have right here is shadow guys I gave her a little cap that came with my creatable world set I got some a fashion pack that had that inside and so it actually fit on her head I thought it would pull out the pops of green and some different things that I did I gave her some accessories the purple and the green because I really wanted to pull those colors out and then also guys she's got on some roller skates and I believe these skates are like monster high skates um, but I think they are so adorable and cute and so guys this is the look that I created for shadow 
Neon Licious is definitely one of my favorites. I love all the pops of color that she has. So bright, so fun. And I gave her kind of a look along those lines. The little dress she has on is actually a boxy girl's dress, guys. It fits rather tight, but it does fit on her. And I love how cute and short and like youthful it looks. Um, she actually has on Dazzle's little like collar thing, whatever you call it. It's cute. And the shoes that she has are some shoes that I got in a lot that I purchased. You guys know that I love my shoes for my LOL Surprise dolls. And these shoes are fantastic. I think it goes well with her outfit. And so guys, this is the look that I created for Neon Licious. So this next doll is very familiar, I'm sure, to everyone. It is Uptown Girl. And Uptown Girl, she normally looks very, very, like, kind of, um, I don't know, very well put together on the professional side. I wanted to give her a kind of country girl swag. And so this is the look that I created for her. I love this little gold like bag that she is carrying. It is so cute, the little heart. So I love her little shorts that she has on and her little top. And these boots guys as well. Nice, nice look for her. And this little like head, head tie that she has on, it actually is a Minnie Mouse outfit from one of the fashion packs for Minnie Mouse. So guys, this is the look that I created for Uptown Girl. I haven't done anything with Cosmic Nova in a while and this is a funky little cute look that I came up with for her. I love her little hair being up like this. I thought that was cute. And these little glasses that she has on, they belong to Dazzle, which I think is fantastic. And look at the little top. I, for some reason, I can't remember the name of the doll series that I got this from but I think it's cute, the little sparkle with it. And this, it's, it's one of the outfits that come with the Barbie that comes with the Crayola markers, but you can kind of see the little Barbie symbol right there. Um, I didn't color it. These were the colors that already came on the little skirt, but I thought it was cute. And it had like a little fruity vibe. So she's got her little pineapple purse, which is cute. These shoes I got in a lot that I purchased of doll clothes, but this is the look that I created for Cosmic Nova. So guys, this is Speedster. I kind of changed her look up a bit and she has a Neon Licious's top. She has a skirt that I purchased from Haunt Couture. Um, she makes awesome LOL Surprise and other doll clothes that fit to a T. And I, these earrings guys are BMR, Barbie, uh, series. These shoes belong to Dazzle. This outfit is very simple but still something that looks really cute. And so guys, this is the look that I created for Speedster. So guys, this is Candy Licious, and I gave her a little different look. I, you know, gave her some cute little earrings and the bustier little top is Haunt Couture. I purchased that and I use it for outfits and all kinds of things to make things, I mean, it really does. It's like an accessory for me. <laughs> the way that I kind of style it. She has on this Barbie dress and this Barbie dress, I mentioned earlier that I had a little Barbie set that came with Crayola markers and these are the Silly Sense markers. They are washable. You can kind of, you know, draw and color the different little outfits and stuff. It came with like a, a top, a dress, um, a skirt, and maybe another piece. So I think it's like four pieces maybe that it came with. And you can do different things with it. But then you can kind of color on the material, but then you can wash it. And then you can do it again at a later date and use different colors. So I thought that was a cool little thing. So this is the look that I gave her along with these shoes. I love the little hot pink shoes. Even though I already opened her up, um, Barbie is still in here. I haven't taken her out yet. Um, she still has on this dress. And you can basically like just color it. Like it says color it and wear it. And so I thought that that was a cool thing to do for some of my LOL surprise stuff. And there's, it comes with actually five markers. If, if you look inside, you see there's four still in there. So the only other marker was this one that I used when I colored uh, the outfit that was on Groovy Babe. So that was like the hot pink kind of color that was on there. But I think that's pretty cool uh, concept. And if you have any black and white items, perhaps for your LOL Surprise OMG dolls, you can kind of color them and do different things. And it's pretty easy. I'm gonna try to color just a little something so you can see.
So there it is right there, all finished. Um, that was the little section that I colored. Now, one thing that I do know is that even when you don't go over the lines, I just realized that it kind of bleeds over a little bit. So you probably want to stay a little bit within the line, but it doesn't have to be perfect. It's just the, you know, it's kind of a, a different look that you can give your little dress. But I think that that is cool, guys. So that is the look that I created for Candy Licious. Okay, so if you were counting, I actually showed you guys 11 looks and I saved the best for last. This right here, guys, is the most fantastic Snowlicious, guys. And I think that she is so, so cute. Um, normally her hair is in braids. I actually took it down and gave it like a little body wave to it. This little uh, like fur hat that I created, I actually made it from a little wristlet that I found. Um, the dress right here is a dress that I got in a lot that I purchased. I believe it's probably Monster High, just like a lot of other things. And this skirt, okay, so the skirt is actually um, Crystal Star skirt. And these shoes are some Snap Star doll shoes. So anyway, I thought that this was a nice little look for Snowlicious. Okay guys, that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play where I showed you guys 12 more looks of some of my awesome LOL Surprise OMG dolls and these unique looks that I created for them. You guys let me know in the comments below what you think about these looks and which one was your favorite. But guys, that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play and we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play. Can't stop thinking about you. Hope you never ever leave from my side. I can't stop thinking about you. Hope you never ever leave. You kill the lies, we come to life. I see the fire in your eyes. I can't stop thinking about you. Hope you never ever leave.